First insert the short vertical beam into the base. Insert the pins at the four corners to fix it, and then insert the R-shaped buckle to lock it. Then put in the lifting sliding sleeve. Place the connection axes in the four corners above the vertical beam, making sure that the holes are aligned with the holes of the vertical beam. Then insert pins at the connection to secure and insert R-shaped buckles to lock. Then align and place the next vertical beam. Insert pins at the connection points to secure and insert R-shaped buckles to lock. Place the connecting axis in the four slots of the lifting sleeve. Pay attention to the alignment of the holes. Insert pins at the connection to fix and insert R-shaped buckles to lock. Repeat the same steps on the other side. Insert the cross arm into the top of the vertical beam. Insert a pin at the connection point to fix it and insert an R-shaped buckle to lock it. Hang up the chain hoist. Repeat the same steps on the other side. Pull the chain. Adjust the hook position to above the beam. Wrap the sling around the beam and hang it into the hook. After completion, we can pull the chain to raise the beam to the designated position. Raise the four legs of the base. Unlock the wheel lock, and the truss can be moved. After finishing the movement, remember to press the wheel lock, put down the foot support, and keep it fixed.